Hey guys, greetings. How you doing? I hope you are doing well. Welcome to Vinal TV. If you are new to this channel and if you are, please consider subscribing. Thank you very much indeed for stopping by. Thank you very much indeed for clicking. I want to show you what we got here. We got this gear. This is HP Lesa Jet Pro M28 W. This printer is multifunctional multi tax triple in one if you like in the sense that you can copy scan and print from this printer it is using 44 air toner original what i want us to do is actually show you some of the stuff for this printer features then for us to connect this printer via usb cable okay if you look over here this printer is right now connected to Wi-Fi network, but I'm going to turn off the Wi-Fi off in a minute and for us to connect this printer via USB cable. Okay, so this printer, this is Wi-Fi network connection. If it's flashing, it means it's not yet connected, but it's connected. This is to cancel if you select a job and change your mind. Okay, this is scroll up arrow, up and down arrow. So if you want to increase the number of documents you want to copy, increase it this way, reduce it by clicking this way. This button here is for you to copy, selection of the copy, okay, you want. So you change the copy setting by pressing this button, okay. Then this button here is to start copying the document you selected okay and this button here is to cancel okay so this is copy selection if you press copy and change your mind you press this to cancel it and it will cancel okay now i want to show you also the paper tray is right here so you load the paper tray right here you use this arrow to adjust the paper tray to different size okay so you use the arrow to adjust it this hook holder here to adjust it to a, this is a5 a bit further is a4 to extremely end is to 8.5 so you load the paper this way and adjust it to the size and also i want to show you here this is the toner right here you take the toner off this is what it looks like and to the, put it back or if you get a new one to replace it you just go in straight there is a hook to the side you need to make sure this one is at the the first one this one goes inside okay so this this big one goes inside this smaller ones goes the bottom one okay so you make sure the same thing on this end here okay from this end you need to make sure the big one for this goes right here this one goes to the bottom okay okay you hear a click sound and close it okay now what i want us to do is to show you how we can connect this printer via usb cable what i want to do is cross off the wi-fi okay to remove the right now you can see there is no wi-fi right now okay wi-fi is no longer on on this printer i want to us to connect this via usb cable remember this printer got usb cable that's can with this is the usb cable that can with it okay but i have usb cable at home which i want to show you how so this book is the book we're going to scan so this is the USB cable and at the back here is the power cable for this printer so this is the power cable okay the USB cable goes right here okay it's universal all the printers is using its brothers can use it. Epson can use it Canon can use it so USB cable goes here okay and the next thing we need to do is I'm going to bring my laptop Okay, so this section 
Okay. So I'm going to turn this printer around. Okay. Okay, to turn it around, okay, to make room. So bring the US the PC. Okay, so this cable goes right here. Okay. Here we go. It's once you connected, it will show you launch the app. Okay, so what we need to do is So if you take it off now and put it back on, for instance, okay, I'm going to put the password for my print printer. Okay, the next thing we need to do is So you launch, click launch app. Once you click launch app, it will take you to HP Smart App. Okay. This is what it's doing right now. It's taking us to HP Smart App and it's showing us already printer is ready. Okay. You can see it's telling us this printer is ready. Once you connect the USB cable, it will pick up straight away. The next thing we need to do is for us to scan this book we have here, okay? You can see, get supplier for ink, scan, smart tags, print table, print document. And if you look over here, it's not, Wi-Fi is not on, okay? It's just because it's connected to USB cable, so it picked this automatically. You can also change printer setting, okay? You can summon for help and support print photo okay what i want us to do is to scan a document to scan a document we need to click on scan right now it's telling us scan is not available please select home to check that the printer is connected and active okay so we need to make sure click home okay and you see here is this printer Okay, before the printer was there was different one. So this printer is right now is ready. So click scan. Or you alternate select home. The scanner is not available. Please select home. Click okay. So we need to make sure. Okay, I need to make sure this printer is on, okay? Here we go, the scanner is right now, it's ready. So you just need to make sure that this printer is connected so right now the scanner is ready so to scan the document okay the next thing to do is from the scanner present scan present you have documents right here okay and also select the type of document if it's photo you select photo okay right now what we have here is book so i will call it document select document if you want to enhance the size, if it's letter, you select letter. If it's A4, select A4. If it's 4x6 or 5x7, you select. What we have here is A4 paper. Okay, so select A4. The next thing is output. Okay, this printer is lesser, so it's only black. Okay, but if it's the one that you load in cartridges, triple color cartridges so you need to select gray for black if it's color you leave it on color so right now it will be gray okay and the source is glass okay resolution you can increase the resolution to 600 dpi or 300 dpi so right now it's on 300 dpi the next thing to do is 
you can select preview if you select preview then it will scan the document for you to see and if there's anything you want to change okay then here we go this is the document okay if there's anything you want to change right now then you adjust it okay you can actually adjust the size okay but if you're happy with it then the next thing to do is the next thing to do is to click scan if you are not happy with it then you adjust the size okay and the job is done so this is the document we scan okay and if you want to print it out the next thing you need to do is click print for your laptop okay if you select print okay and when you select print you make sure we you select the particular printer you have here what we have here is lesserjet pro m28 i got so many other printers here on my laptop so i need to make sure i have this correct printer okay so you need to scroll down okay and look for use the button arrow to use look for lesser 28 here we go lesser 28 23 select it okay the next thing to do is for you to okay click print here we go it's right now okay so this is how to scan your document from this printer okay and send it to your email and print it out okay if you want to send it to your inbox the next thing to do is click okay the next thing to do you can click share you if you also want to download it you click download if you click download it will be saved okay inside your file okay you can save it click download you go and save it on your picture or anywhere you on any, any file you want to save it okay this is by the way so if you save it now right now you can type it okay hp okay then click save so document file save click okay okay and now if you want to share you click share it give you the option for you to send it to email straight away right now it's attached on my inbox i'm gonna put it send it back to my inbox okay so make sure send it back to my inbox or you can if you know the email address to the person you want to send it you type the email address of the person the next thing you need to do is click send right now is sending mail is sent off so we come out from this app okay our job here is finished you go now to your inbox and look for this document we send sometimes it take a few minutes okay sometimes depend on how fast okay it will take a few minutes to land inside your inbox the other one i did with my mobile phone landed very quick okay so what we need to do is right now we, here we go it just landed click on the document we send click it open here we go is there okay here we go this is the document we send okay you can actually print it out okay you can print it out if you like select print make sure you look for the printer okay we have here is m28 so look for m28 hp m28 here we go here it is it will tell you it's ready so you can you can print on both sides right now if you want you select both sides and print it will print on both sides but it won't print on both sides because it's only one document okay if you want to print on both want it to print on both sides i'm going to show you also how to do this right now so to print to print this document on both sides what you need to do is for instance the same pattern you scan this document okay go to the app okay so you go to hp app and scan it twice 
sometimes people ask me how do you print on both sides so you need to make sure you go and look for the app what we are doing right now is going back to the app here we go hp smart app okay it's ready scan the document okay scan first one okay this is the first one okay is there the next thing to do is scan the second one okay so click plus okay and the same procedure click scan so it will be two document we scan okay so this is the first one this is the second one the next thing to do is I want us to share this document again the same procedure share okay it will land to my inbox okay put my in inbox okay it's in click send here we go it sent off so come off from the app and go back right now to the inbox and look for this document we sent okay So we we'll look for this document we send right now. It will be two documents opened. Which I want to show you how we can save paper by making sure that we we'll have the two document. So here we go. The document just landed. 1425. Click it open. Okay. It's right now. It's open. Okay. This is the first one. This is the second one. Now, what I want us to do, click scan. I mean, print. Okay. Is there already? It's ready. Now, okay. What I want us to do, print on both sides. Okay. Print on both sides. Okay. You s the next thing to do is click print so once you select print on both sides the first side of the comment is printing the printing is completed okay Click continue. Okay. It's showing us this error. one of two print on both side click print to see if, if it work okay this is how to okay what one thing I notice is this printer you can okay it's printing unfortunately unfortunately you cannot print on both sides on this printer okay but this is how to print and scan your document okay with USB cable if you look over here there's no Wi-Fi network is we connected this via USB cable thank you very much